this painting is something I hear about all the time. Viewers seem equal parts annoyed and disappointed that Parrish didn't look like this when he was fully flamed up and fighting Sebastian. Now, I kind of understood at the time that this is an artist impression of a hellhound painted by someone who had never seen a hellhound. They were like, it's a big human-shaped dog, and it's angry and on fire. And since they didn't have artificial intelligence back then, they had to punch all that information into a regular meat-based intelligence called a painter, and it then came up with this and scribbled it on the wall. Then someone came along later and plastered and tiled over it, Maybe because they'd figured out it wasn't at all what a hellhound looked like and or they decided they didn't want the creepy mural accent wall after all. I kind of understand why people might expect this to be a literal interpretation of a hellhound because the guy did capture Sebastian's likeness so well. But then again, lots of people saw Sebastian and there was tons written about him so there was a lot more information to go on, probably. But hellhounds look different in every culture. Sometimes they have three heads and snake heads. So if the remit is just draw me a hellhound, you could end up with almost anything. Hey guys, you want to go scaring? <laughs> you want to go scaring? Okay. Besides, paintings don't always have to reflect real life. I mean, that guy Jesus didn't look anything like any of these paintings because none of these artists ever met him, and the Bible just says something along the lines of he was this average-looking dude. He probably didn't have a flaming hoop around his head either. The Teen Wolf Hellhound is just a human body possessed by an eternal dog-like spirit that is sometimes on fire. It was never going to look like this.